I've heard you missed my voice and I'll be honest, I have missed my own chats as well, so here I am, super excited. <sighs> love you to close your eyes and imagine yourself in this magical world of watercolors. If you beginner especially, please promise me to try. Grab your papers, grab some paints. I'm using Arteza watercolor gouaches, but honestly, you can use any watercolors you own. Actually, you can even try to use any paints you have. Even if those are kids paints, that's okay. You know what's the biggest problem that we have? We are afraid to try. We are comparing ourselves to others and we think we're not good enough. What's worse, we think this is too much, too difficult. I will never be able to do as good as she does. Wrong thinking, my friends, because honestly, I'm a beginner as much as you are and most of the time I'm not really sure of what I'm doing. It's an experiment, it's just a trial, it's just having fun. And the main thing is, to try. So please promise me now, when you're watching this, pause the video, grab the paints and just start painting those silly circles with me. Look, this is nothing, nothing difficult. This is something even a child could do and no, I'm not trying to compare you to children, but honestly, this is really easy and simple. It is achievable and I think this is the beauty of this video. It is for you, it is for me, it is for someone who never tried painting, it is for everyone. The main thing is to trust the process, sit down at the desk and just do it. I'll be honest, this is the most satisfying, this is the most uh, achievable project you nearly will meet because this is really something as simple as it looks. At the end of this video, if you will keep watching, you will see my trials in the evening because I really wanted to do more and more and then you will see Hannah as well painting so watch till the end please check the video description box uh, because this pencil pen um, biro whatever it is it is phenomenal the best i have ever 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 used as you will see yourself it's it didn't start working for one second it was just perfect it's very delicate fine line it's a brand that it wouldn't be typical for doodles for artists for um, mixed media artists journalers <laughs> it is just more for um, writing it's a pilot brand I by accident discovered it and the second I started using it I was wow this is amazing and I didn't stop using ever since I even got five more pen pens pens of this sort i always have this trouble whether it's a pen or pencil um, english is not my first language as you know and i do have trouble always remembering it's a pencil or pen or marker or whichever that is so as you can see i'm not leaving you with music only i do chit chat uh, because we have only a few minutes together here on this video but i really would love you to have a look how simple that is detailed but also so super fun I would love you to believe in what I'm saying. I would love you to grab the paints because I think honestly every time uh, I read some comments I hear oh I didn't do it for ages and I'm thinking why? But I know the answer. I haven't touched my watercolors in months and months and I, d I do believe this is the hardest part. It's like with everything. If you try to be healthy, the worst is to start to have that first health, healthy dinner and maybe go for a jog or a walk. Same with the art. If you forgot how it is to use watercolors, um, it's just so difficult to do it, so difficult to grab it. So I encourage you, I ask you kindly to trust me and to do it. Please, I would love you to make those trees uh, with me because it's something you will be happy about once it's done. And it's not about how pretty it is. It's not about how special and amazing. It's not about how good. Is it as good as mine? Is it as good as hers? No, it's 
is it good for my mind because these days the most important for me when I craft, when I art, when I paint, when I do anything in the studio, I just try to focus how beneficial it is for my mind. These days it's such a difficult times. It has been for the past months and years now we can say that uh, making art for mental health it's crucial, it's important. And I would love you to believe that it is actually very handy, helpful, it's super important and watercolors of this kind doesn't cost you much money, doesn't cost you much time. It is a little doodle, a little painting and that's it. So I hope I convinced you, I hope you are keep on watching and if you do, I'm gonna be a real YouTuber right now and ask you to please share this video with your friends. Maybe maybe there are people like your neighbors, your close friends, someone from your family that really needs to see this video and try because I do believe you don't have to be anywhere near professional to try, to start, because anything you will grab will be just right. So I would love you to share this video, maybe send the link to your friends on the private message. Definitely, if you could, hit the like button, 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 bottom, <laughs> you know, that little handy, ha handy hand, if you could hit that, that would be amazing. And if you could do even more and leave me a comment, that would mean the world to me and it's so funny that you don't see myself but I'm making tons of gestures right now asking and with the from the bottom of my heart with the biggest trials of for you to understand how super important it is for me for other creators especially crafters and um, you would see me actually just making gestures gesticulating all around at the studio you would laugh uh, but honestly if you could let me know what you think let me know if you will try this project with me if you will actually um maybe try something else and just play my video in the background that's perfectly fine i keep on chatting halfway through i didn't even allow you to relax in this video you know what you can mute my voice <laughs> as well if you don't like the chatty ones but for a change i listened to what you said recently saying i really loved your video marta there was the art journaling one it was short and sweet with the noises and everything but tons of you like i mean hundreds have said i missed your voice and i understand you don't always have to talk and that's okay we don't expect that but i know how much you love it honestly um i do like my voice as well in the videos somehow um maybe not in the real life in the reality but in the videos i do miss it sometimes as well so i hope i'm fulfilling your hopes and i'm hoping that this video is bringing you smiles and happiness and a little bit of a cheerfulness because this is where what i am who i am uh trying to be as cheerful as I can because life is too short and we just have to appreciate every day as it comes as it is and just appreciate what we have appreciate the fact that I can record and you can watch and we can just be in such a great symbiosis here together this is such a blessing the fact every time I think about me as a creator that I record those videos the fact that I can chat to you I can make this video show you what's in my mind show you what's in my soul the fact that I can actually do it across the globe to so many people it's just crazy and here if you're watching how about letting me know where are you from uh, are you watching from Argentina from South Africa these are the, some of the countries destinations that I've heard over the years are you from maybe Germany maybe you are from Poland maybe Ireland England where are you from my beautiful friends those who are watching those who are full um, faithful watching till now the mark 9 of this video of Marta chit-chatting chit-chatting never stopping so I'm smiling and I'm super happy because I really was excited about this video I have to be honest um, I wanted something that it's uh, autumn niche, but also something simple and also something different to what we've done so far. Autumn niche, not necessarily the pumpkins anymore. So I think these trees are fantastic. And if you could uh, go back at the beginning of the video, the most important part of this, I think, was to grabbing the paints, the colors that will make a beautiful, absolutely beautiful uh, color palette. So choose few colors for yourself and start from that choosing few colors on the palette if you don't have such a fancy glancy 
fancy fancy palette as I do, you can use just a plate, you know, cooking plate, plate from your sandwich, you can just use that and put your paints on that. For many years I've done that, uh, somehow, I don't know, I got the palette because we crafters are hoarders, we just can't we just can't let go of the beautiful supplies around us and sometimes if we're lucky if you curious about this palette it's from Sostrene Grene it's the local store here in Ireland in Cork and um, but I'm sure you can make it yourself maybe we can do it together or you can just try to substitute with the plate as I have mentioned or some plastic um, cover or just a palette box whichever and there was something else I wanted to say oh yes the paints as I have mentioned those are watercolors you can try you can really be courageous and try with whatever supplies you have I've been chatting not about the techniques in this video which I hope you don't mind but it's so straightforward splashes 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 at the end we are finishing here my beautiful Beautiful friends oh I've been chatting chatting but I hope you liked it and enjoyed it and now in the end it's my evening and Hannah enjoy forgot to mention thank you so much for watching something feels missing something's not right I had it all written but the ink never dried throw out the page what do I say if all I thought I wanted went running away? One deep breath out, one deep breath.